Hi, my beautiful Aries, and welcome to Arcana Priestess. So for those of you that are new, welcome, and if you are returning, I'm glad to have you. All right, so for Aries, the overall energy when I was doing the pre-shuffle for you guys is justice. So there is some sort of divine intervention that's coming in here where you are getting justice from a situation that is no longer serving you. Okay. This is what you're getting justice from. What is that like Beyonce quote um, or the lyric? It's um, the best revenge is my is getting my paper. That's ultimately what's coming in. There is some sort of karmic balance that's coming in, like karmic balance is being restored. And it seems like for some of you, this is like a 12 year cycle. For others of you, this is like a four year cycle where there is going to be a lot of blessings that are coming in that might've been blocked from certain people that you were surrounded with, certain situations that were in your energy here. You're coming into this place where your intuition is gonna be incredibly strong. You're gonna be able to listen to it and you're gonna be moving through your intuition. So you're gonna find that life is becoming a lot more beautiful that you are working with the energy of the universe and through embodying that energy you are creating the life that you've always wanted for yourself this is very powerful for you guys you're gonna feel very seen the two of cups wow for some of you this justice is in love some of you what your justice is is those people that treated you like crap it's them getting to watch you be in love with the love of your life, okay? Because even the people that you think can't stand you, they still have no problem watching you, watching the things that you do. You are a natural influencer. You naturally influence people. And some of you, you're just like, I have 30 followers. I have like 300 followers. Like, well, what are you talking about? It doesn't matter how many you have. Those people, but the thing is though, Regardless of how many followers you have, there are a lot more people that watch you that are not following you. I'm hearing bots, I'm hearing fake accounts, very interesting here. Um, because the thing is, you always keep blowing, you always keep improving, you always keep, it's like, what's next? Like, people can't keep up with you, they don't know what's going to happen. With this Two of Cups here, your love life is about to be flourishing in a way where you're going to feel seen, you're going to feel loved, you're gonna feel cherished. I mean, the eye contact, for some of you, this is new love, the eye contact that you're gonna have with this person is going to be unbelievably strong. The chemistry, like, you're just always gonna to wanna to be around this person, you're always gonna to wanna to touch them, you're always gonna wanna be, want to be in their energy, you're gonna to wanna to be in their presence. This is somebody that you're going to look up to, you're gonna be inspired by, you're gonna be able to learn a lot from this person. I feel like this is a perfect match for you. This is a perfect match for you. And this is somebody where the attraction is going to be seen from other people. It's going to be felt by you guys, but it's going to be just the way that you guys, your eyes freaking glimmer when you look at this person. It's like, come on. Still, like, you know what I mean? It's one of those loves that starts off strong, but it, it starts off strong, but also light. But then it develops to stronger and deeper. There's a depth you guys understand each other's souls. It's like you're the only person that can whisper to their soul, that can speak to their soul. They're the only person that can whisper to yours and speak to yours. This is a magnetic kind of love. For some of you, this could be with a Libra. This could be with a water sign. With perfect match, this could be another Aries or another fire sign, Sag Aries Leo here. You guys have very different looks. Like people might think that you, like this isn't your usual type, or maybe people might think like they wouldn't picture the two of you guys together, but like it somehow just works so well, right? Like think of like the skateboarder with the fashionista, right? Like very, very opposite energy, but like the, the draw, the pull is like electric, it's magnifying right think of the supermodel with the tech person like there's just like i don't know like you 
don't look like you go together, but you also do look like you go. I think at first glimpse, people like might do a double take, but then like they see you guys together for a second and it's like, I want that. I, I want that. You're gonna be in a love situation that inspires many people. It's on, like honestly kind of interesting because what I'm getting is you might inspire some people to get out of, it might be that you embodying this beautiful relationship inspires some of your friends or family members that you've known need to leave their partners for a long time maybe you've been giving advice or whatever but it might be like through the action of your love life that you inspire people to make massive changes in their love it's almost like you're going to be inspiring people in your life and they're going to be inspiring people in their life to truly realize that they can have it all because it's not like your love life has always been perfect. I mean, you've been through the ringer just as much as anybody else, maybe even more, right? But for a lot of you, you don't have to worry. Whatever's happening right now in your love life, it's all gonna work out for the best. For a lot of you, if you were single and you're just like, when is it gonna happen? Timing this, that, let it go, because it's coming in. If it's new love, it's coming in within the next two months. Libra season is going to be very powerful for friendships, partnerships, love. You just being appreciated, you being acknowledged, you being seen for who it is that you actually are. There's this level of worship, King of Swords, the Magician, wow, and the Five of Pentacles. With the Four of Cups. King of Swords with the Magician. You are being called for the month of August to be very dedicated with what it is that you want. You're being called to really focus on your words. Say what you mean, do what you say. You are going to be given all of the tools that you need to create the life that you desire. And it is going to be, it's almost like life is gonna be very easy for you. You're gonna see the goal. You're gonna see exactly how to do it. The tools are gonna become available to you and you're gonna follow through with it. It's like, it's as easy as counting to one, two, three. That's how easy your life is about to get. And this is just the start of it because this is just the start of you embodying that energy. And it's something that you're going to take with you through the rest of your life. So this is the start of life getting a lot easier for you and you being able to manifest things at rapid speed. You've released what isn't working, what isn't for you. And doing that made room for the things that have just been kind of like waiting for you. It's like you're at this red light, you're waiting for it to go green, it's about to go green. And as soon as it goes green, everything just moves forward. It's kind of giving me like chariot energy. Some of you could be with a Cancer. We have Aquarius energy coming in here. Five of Pentacles and the Four of Cups. Yeah, for some of you, you're going to be quite surprised because when it comes to love, like your love life might have been lacking for quite some time. You could have been in a relationship where you don't see eye to eye or you want different things from that person. Um, or you just could have like, you, there was just like, they just didn't spark. Like there wasn't that spark. Like you weren't entertained enough, right? Like it could have been a long-term relationship that just felt like it was just dying or it just felt like there was no passion and you were just like friends or something like that here. But you're, you're releasing like, and you know, when people talk about releasing things that don't serve us, it can be something so small. Like it can ultimately just be like, you don't have any hobbies and you're kind of bored with your life. So you're getting new hobbies, right? It's like, you're looking at what's not working and you're replacing it with things that are working here. Some of you, you're going to be coming out of a place where you're working for someone that you don't like or doing something you don't like but you're also not making a lot of money and you're going to be moving into a place with the magician and the king of swords where you are going into a job where you're going to be manifesting you're going to be deciding how much money you want and that's the money that you're going to be making but not only are you going to be doing that you're going to actually be very passionate about what it is that you do you might be leaving a career and walking into a purpose walking into something that is divinely in alignment for you, okay? So I do feel like for a lot of you, it's one or the other, it's gonna be love or it's going to be career, but there is something massive coming in here for you. It's like there's no more time for like crying over things that are not working anymore because you're seeing the light, you're seeing the path ahead, you're seeing how much more beautiful it is. And that the only, it's like the only tears moving, this is so cute. The only tears moving forward are gonna be happy tears for you. The Ace of Pentacles, yeah. It's your golden opportunity. And it's, look at this, look how close you are to touching it. 
you are literally a centimeter away from getting everything that you want. So for some of you, this is an energy that's fully going to be manifested in Virgo season, and you're gonna start slowly seeing the signs, getting the tools. Like you're gonna slowly start seeing the light, but you're gonna be fully in the light, fully embodying the light once um, Virgo season hits. All right, love, so that's what I have for you. I hope that you guys enjoyed this reading as much as I enjoyed reading for you. I love you guys so much, and I'll see you soon. Take care, my loves.